The extension of the left arm limits the width of the arc which the backswing can follow. If the left arm is not taut, its extension is indefinite and the swing may go anywhere. But if it is fully extended, the arc of the swing will be as wide and therefore as long as possible, allowing the greatest time to gain speed before impact. The left arm must be straight at impact. It is possible to straighten it during the downswing, but the more certain and therefore more consistent method is to keep it reasonably straight from the start. The best way to assure a full extension of the left arm is to use it in pushing the club back, not independently of the body turn, but assisted by the movement of the entire left side. Addressing the ball as I do, about opposite the toe or instep of the left foot, there's no perceptible lateral movement of the hips during the backswing. I'm already well behind the ball, where I can move into the shot as I swing through. The turn of the body takes place approximately around the spine as an axis and the head does not move appreciably either sidewise or in an up and down direction. Many players make the mistake of ducking or lowering the left shoulder during the backswing. This shoulder does move around under the chin, but it does so naturally as the body turns on an inclined axis. <laughs> <laughs> 